We're in Seattle, Washington, ready to bring you another great NFL matchup. Welcome to this NFC West matchup as the 49ers get set to take on the Seahawks. Let's see how it plays out today as we get set for the kickoff. Number 14 in to kick this one off. A mistake by the kicker on that one. Kickoff, out of bounds. The team with the most discipline is the team that doesn't commit stupid penalties. And they're the team that usually executes better. John, if I say defense wins championships, the cliche police will arrest me. But I'm going to say it anyway, as two of the very best are out there for this one. And these are the games that I really love to watch. It's all about ball control and limiting the mistakes that you make on offense. Both of these teams have a ton of talent on the defensive side. And I'll tell you one thing for sure. It's going to be tough to score points in this one. It'll probably be a dogfight right down to the end. Second and four. Ball on the 44 yard line. Hey, hey, hey! Chris Here we go. Here's a flat guy! Hey, let's go! Here they come. Going long. Almost intercepted. He deflected it just in time to avert the completion. The Seahawks come out in the 4-3. Throws it. And this pass is completed. The 30. Number 54 comes up to make the play. At the 19. Perfect spiral on that pass. This is a guy who can make all the throws out there. He shows a nice touch in the short patterns. Can thread it in there against tight coverage. And he can put some air on it. And he's trying something downfield. Number nine sends a man in motion. Here they come. Gets rid of it. Pass falls incomplete. Number 27 comes up to knock that ball out of the receiver's hands before he was able to get control of it. Yeah, we see a lot of footballs popping up when he makes contact. And his instincts know when to deliver the hit and how to do it. Second and ten. Ball on the 19 yard line. Hey, let's go. Here we go, baby. The Seahawks line up in a 4-3. Pressure. You got to give a lot of credit to this defensive line. They got a good push in the middle, and he was right there to bring him down. So on third down, they have to get it to the nine to pick up the first. The Seahawks come out in a dime package. Gets rid of it. He hits his receiver. Murphy is there on the stop at the 14. Terrell doesn't get enough to convert, and that brings up fourth down. Waller will try to give his team the lead with this field goal attempt. The veteran kicks it through. Good. Decent drive turning their first possession into three points. And you want to get something on your first possession. They were looking for a touchdown, but the defense kind of tightened up. San Francisco is lined up for the kickoff. Barnes back to return. 
This one is taken by Barnes. Seattle is trying to take the lead on this drive as they take over. They'll First and ten at the twenty yard line. First and ten. Watch out. Watch screen. Let's go. Seattle Bring using up. three Bring linebackers. Bring it. Hand off to the tailback. Screen is there on the stop at the 29. You can't have a good running attack without blocking. The blocking alone won't get you what you need. You got to have a back who can find the holes when they're there. Second and one. Ball on the 29 yard line. From the start, from the start. Watch the hard count. Campbell. Turn it out and out. Crosses it out to the left. Runs him over. Bradford is there for the tackle at the 34. This is tough running here. Let's watch him as he gets through right here. And he breaks a tackle and keeps moving forward. I tell you, this guy's hard to bring down. the fumble that was a lucky bounce second and eight coming up here number 21 the lone back hand it off to the back Swift comes up to make the play. And that game will get them a fresh set of downs. It was a great run. He saw his blockers create some room for him, and he accelerated right through the hole. First and ten. Ball on the 46 yard line. Hey, let's go. The 49ers line up in a 4 3. I'm coming through, baby. Let's go now. Gets the call. Bradford is there on the stop at the 49-yard line. This team's always trying to get a good mix of run and pass plays. Second and seven. Ball on the 49-yard line. It's showtime, baby. Here we go. Watch each other's back. Only one man in the backfield. Throws it. He hits his receiver. Pushes off. Green comes up to make the play at the 48 yard line. Gain of two. On third down, they have to get the ball to the 44 to convert. McGuire, the man in motion. Closing in. Long throw. That should have been a long completion on third down. Bannister back to return. Fair catch called for. Deep in their own territory. We're talking about Green. They'll go from the I formation. All on us, y'all. Everything you've got. Tucks it away. Nice play for it. Ooh, nearly picked off. Alexander was the intended receiver on that play. And had the coverage on the play. Second and ten. Number 23, the long back. He tucks it away. Wooden comes up to make the play at the 10 yard line. One thing these guys don't want to do is give up in a running game. Because if they do that, 
They become one dimensional. And that plays right into the defense's hand. Gain of about a yard. Ball on the 10 yard line. Number 23, the lone back. With the throw. And this pass is complete. Number 30 is there for the tackle at the 21. Excellent recognition by the receiver, reading the coverage and adjusting his route accordingly. Option routes are receiving routes designed to take advantage of the coverage. It's up to both the receiver and the quarterback to make the same read. If the receiver reads zone, but the quarterback reads man, you can see passes going right to the defender. In this direction. Johnson got very good penetration there. I tell you, the quickest way down the field is straight ahead. Going outside, dancing around and all that stuff, that's not going to help you move the ball. Ball on their own 18. Ball on the 18-yard line. It's the pass off. Sends the pass. And he's knocked out of bounds. At the 45, number 27. Looks to be shaken up after that play, and we'll get you a report from the sideline when we get the information. First and 10. Ball on the 45 yard line. You can't stop me. Number 23 lines up behind his fullback in the eye. Hand off to the tailback. Number 30 comes up to make the play at the 45-yard line. When your offensive line is getting a good push up front, it's a lot easier to pick up yardage on the ground. Second and about one. So now in regard to that injury, he's out for the rest of the game. Apparently the hand injury is more serious than originally thought. With the pass, and he hits his target. Tanner is there on the stop at the 37-yard line. They completed the pass for a first down. And they did it against the cover, too. So the quarterback found a soft spot, and he got it in there. Ball on the 37-yard line. Ball on the 37-yard line. The Seahawks line up in a 4-3. Looking for room. Fakes the handle. Throws it. And the catch is made. Stratton is there for the tackle at the 26-yard line. They throw it and pick up a second consecutive first down. Well, when you start to establish something, you want to keep it going until the defense finds a way to stop you. First and 10. Number 23, Malone setback. He gets the count. Murphy comes up to make the play at the 25. One yard number 23 yard takes it up the middle for a yard or two. Second, Second and nine. nine. Ball on the 25-yard line. Right, here we go. The Seahawks come out in a dime package. Hey, hey, hey. off to the tailback. Murphy is there on the stop at the 24. When you run the ball in the first half, you're trying to keep the defense on. But if you're only getting gains like that in the second half, then it puts more pressure on your passing game. If they could get it to the 16-yard line, that would be a first down. The 49ers line up in a five-receiver set this time. Drops back. Doesn't get much behind it. Number 54 makes the tackle at the 20 yard line. Bowen didn't get enough for the first. So at the end of one, the score is 3 0. 49ers. San Francisco. Seattle. And we're ready to start the second quarter. This officially will be a 37-yard attempt. The field goal attempt is good. 
they were able to pick up a few first downs there to give their kicker a chance. And he was able to do the rest to make it an effective drive. This one is taken by Barnes. And they're about ready to get this drive started after the last series ended with a punt. First, First and ten. ten. The 49ers with a four-man front receives the handle. Mixon runs with passes, keeps the defense on. adjust his throw and it messed up his rhythm. Second and ten. Ball on the 20 yard line. The Seahawks come out with one linebacker and several defensive backs. Under pressure, this pass is incomplete. Sometimes you see a quarterback purposely underthrow a receiver. So the defensive back overruns it. I don't think that was the case there. Turner was the one they were trying to get the ball to. Third and ten. Ball on the 20 yard line. Never over your head. Only one man back. Dropping back. Pressure coming. Throws it. Tanner brings him down at the 12 yard line. So they're able to get the field goal kicker in a little better position. So this should be an easy three. The veteran connecting with a field goal. And give credit to the kicker there. It's nice to have a guy that can make your drive worth three, even if you don't get it into the end zone every time. This one is taken by Barnes. This is where you want to respond quickly, or this could turn into a battle for field position. The first and ten will start the drive at the 20 yard line. First and ten. Not today. The drop out. Seattle lines up in a 4 3. is there on the stop at the 19-yard line. So let's take a look at how this back compares to the opposition. Second and 11. Ball on the 19-yard line. Here we go, baby. Here we go. Seattle comes out in a 4-3 on the carry. Setting up play action. Gets rid of it. Swift is there for the tackle at the 42-yard line. That powerful arm brings them a first down this time. Yeah, and you talk about putting some heat on your throws. This guy really let it go. 
First Ball on their 10. own 42. Ball on the 42-yard line. The 49ers come out in a nickel back. Smith is there on the stop. If they keep getting games like this, it could really open up things for them in the second half. Picked up about six yards that time. Second and four. Ball on the 47-yard line. Seattle lines up in a 4-3. Fakes the handle. And the catch is made. He zips that pass there, picks up the first down. You look for the open guy in any play, but there is a progression. You look to your first guy, then your second, and so on. He did a nice job of going through the progression that time. First and ten. Ball on the 44-yard line. Get it up! The 49ers come out in a 4-3. This one will be spotted at the 39. So that tackle was his third. This is one of those games where you just keep running it at him. Four yards here, five yards there, and loosen him up, and then wham. You knock him out late in the game with that long touchdown run. Four yard game. Hey, let's go. All on us, y'all. Dime backs in for this play. They give it to the halfback. Nice play fit. He made the catch. You have to play him physically off the line. Bump him off his route, jam him, stuff like that. Because I'll tell you this, if you give him a free release and he can get behind you, he can do some real damage. It's first and goal at the three-yard line. Keep the throttle down. Lops one into the end zone. Makes the grab. Touchdown, Touchdown. Seattle. Seattle. Veteran is able to come down with a pass in the end zone. This is what good, experienced receivers do. They excel when they're given the opportunity to make big plays. The point after is good. Now that's just the type of thing that you come to expect from these guys. They do a really good job scripting the plays that they're going to be running. And they do a great job of executing them when they run them. Number 14 will be kicking off. Not the type of kickoff they wanted. Test plays and takeaways can really kill a team. Usually the team with the fewest mistakes out there will win the game. It's first and ten. The backs are lined up in an eye. Nice play fake. He made the catch. This one will be spotted at the 22. That's his third tackle of the contest. He brings it in for a big game. Almost every wide receiver gets better at running routes as they get older. And this guy's no exception. to make the play at the 20 yard line and now our viewers can see how successful each team's main running threat has been today let's see what they can do in the red zone the last red zone trip resulted in a field goal With the pass, almost picked off. Stratton got his hands on him. He's a pretty good cover linebacker. He can run with most guys, and he gets good position. 
Then he reads the pass and he makes his move. He'll drop a few like that one. Third and seven. Ball on the 20 yard line. Nothing. I don't get nothing. The Seahawks come out of the nickel pack. Number 30 is there for the tackle at the 18 yard line. So they come up short of the first on third down, and we should see the kicker here. Five now following the successful field goal attempt. San Francisco is lined up for the kickoff. Barnes back to return. This one is handled by Barnes. And we'll see if they can move the ball as well through the air this time as they did after scoring a touchdown on their last possession. The ball Seahawks on their own 20. Start the drive at the 20 yard line. First and 10. Nickelback in this time. With the throw. Pushed out at the 29 yard line. I like the quick decision by the quarterback. The defense didn't have time to react. Picked up nine on the play. Second and one. Ball on the 29 yard line. Play hard and fast. Tucks it away. Swift is there for the tackle at the 39. And was able to create a lot of space on that run, John. Well, it started with some good blocking. And when he got through there, he turned up field, and they weren't in position to tackle him. Ball on their own 39. Ball on the 39 yard line. The 49ers line up in a 4 3. Bradford comes up to make the play at the 43. Now let's have a look at what our runners have done up to this point. Almost at the two minute mark now. The 49ers come out in a nickel package. They'll spot this one at the 48 yard line. He makes his fifth stop of the game on that play. Good call there, John. The draw caught them off guard. And here's the thing running draw plays softens up the defense and slows down the pass rush. When you can run a draw for good yardage, you really open things up for the passing game. Hey, let's go. And we've reached the two minute mark here in the first half. Let's go, be good. The 49ers come out in a nickel pack. Pass play here on first down. Gets rid of it. Right on target to the wide receivers. So they're able to pick up another first down. And this offense is clicking. They're making the right calls at the right time. What they're doing here is keeping the defense from huddling up. It keeps the same defense on the field. With the throw. Good call by the defense as they sent the corner on a blitz. He just had too much pressure in his face to see anything. And he threw one out there. Lucky for him it wasn't picked off. Second and ten. Ball on the 34 yard line. I'm coming through, baby. Seattle comes out in a 4-3. With the counter play. Green comes up to make the play. Here's a no huddle. It's a good way to keep the defense off balance. Danny, Danny, Danny. Steps up. Pressure. Gets the pass off. And the catch is made. He couldn't get past the sticks, and that'll bring up fourth down. Right. 
So they're lining up for the kick. This will be a 42-yard attempt. The field goal attempt is good. Not every drive is going to get you a touchdown. So getting three was big. Now they got to go over what worked and what didn't. So the next drive will get him a TD. Number 14. Looks like he's just about ready to kick this one off. He got all of it, and it sails out of the end zone. No one has really taken control so far in this one. It's still anyone's game. Ball on their own 20. Ball on the 20 yard line. The 49ers line up in a five receiver set this time. Pass play here on first down. Closing in. Gets rid of it. And it's intercepted. Number nine has that one picked off. The ball and the defender and the receiver all got there at the same time. So they're ready to go on offense after the interception. They'll start at the 23-yard line. Seattle lines up in a 4-3. Looking upfield. Play action. Throws it. Drops the interception. Edwards was his intended target. Green with the coverage. Second and 10. Ball on the 23-yard line. Seattle comes out in a 4-3. Give it to the halfback. Swift comes up to make the play at the 16-yard line. It could be time for all those big guys up front to do their thing. If the defense can hold them, they should have some time to get a drive of their own going. It's third down now. To convert, they have to get it to the 13. They got it into the end zone on their last red zone drive. Humby is there for the tackle at the 16. They can't get the first down, but they're in field goal range. This kick is for the lead. Seattle bangs that one right through his second field goal of the game. Seattle now leads for the first time in the game. You know, they've got some very good players who can score on you fast. They tend to really get going as the game wears on. Number 14 comes in to kick off. Not a good kick, and it'll cost him. Number 14. Penalties and takeaways are just as big a factor in some games as effective offense. The team that stays mistake free usually wins the game. It's first and 10. Out of the shotgun. Looking for the long completion. Nearly intercepted. Close to a big play by the defense. And it probably should have been a big play. He had perfect position to get the interception. He just dropped it. Second and ten. Ball on the 46 yard line. Out of the gun. Drops back. Gets rid of it. 
Barnes is there on the stop. And here's a look at each team's success on third down so far. Blitz is coming with the throw. And he hits his target. Bush is there for this tackle at the 34. I like to hurry up here. It's a change of pace, and it's a way to get the defense uncomfortable. Here we go. Gets the pass off. And it's complete. Barnes with the tackle at the 12 yard line. The injury sustained earlier was minor, and they expect him to return to the game after a series or two. Pump faking. Under pressure. Trying for the end zone before halftime. Oh, man. He had it in the end zone, but dropped it. One person breathing a sigh of relief is the quarterback. This kick can give his team the lead. The attack is good. The key to winning is having your drives get some sort of points for your team. They got it done on that drive. And I'm sure they'll think a touchdown for their next one. Waller in to kick this one off. Going with the squib kick. From the seven yard line. The Seahawks need to score quickly as they start this drive at the 33 yard line. Ball on their own 33. The Seahawks line up in trips bunch. Gets the pass off. This one will be spotted at the 35-yard line. He's in on that stop. Gets credited with tackle number six. Number 89. Didn't have much room to do anything with that one. Yeah, they had the coverage, and they made the sure play instead of buying something fancy, like going for the pick. We're talking about Reed. Yeah. From the start, from the start. No, one, one, one. Gets rid of it. Low throw, but he has it. He was really hit hard on that play. Number 19. Stops the clock with that timeout. And this should be the last play of the half. Ball on the 48-yard line. Seattle comes out on the quarter defense. Throws it. Incomplete as the defender knocks it away. We've reached the halfway point. Quite a contest to this point with the score. The 49ers ahead of the Seahawks, 15-13. We're ready to begin the fourth quarter. Waller will be kicking off. This one is fielded by Barnes. The momentum has been going back and forth so far. This one looks like it's going to be a close game right till the end. Swift goes back into the game after being injured earlier. The 49ers line up in a 4-3. Big time lick. That was just a big time play by the defense. He got low on the defensive line. They pushed the pocket, and they were right there to bring him down. Following the sack, it's second and long. Ball on the 16-yard line. Let's turn it up, D. The 49ers come out in a 4-3. Tosses it left. Cumby comes up to make the play at the 21 yard line. The best backs in the league average four to five yards a carry, but there are a lot of things that go into a successful running game. 
You got to have good play calling, good blocking up front, a back that can take advantage when he sees the open. Dropping back. Pressure coming. Rosen jumps up. He has it. McGuire is there on the stop. Lawson makes a very difficult catch. When you go up like that, coming down with it is usually not much fun, especially when you got guys nearby who are waiting to put a lick on you. First and ten. Ball on the 30-yard line. The backs are lined up in an eye. A little misdirection. Aiden comes up to make the play at the 31. He was looking for a place to run, but all those places were filled up with guys waiting to tackle him. Second and nine. Ball on the 31 yard line. Seattle comes out in a 4 3. Give it to the halfback. Smith is there on the stunt at the 33. The defensive tackle surge through the line to bring the runner down. Third it's third down, seven. seven to go. Ball on the 33 yard line. Let's turn it up, Only one man in the backfield. Pressure with the throw. Right on target to the wide receiver. That powerful arm brings them a first down this time. Not only did the quarterback show off his strong arm, but the receiver displayed some amazingly soft hands. A great throw with an even better catch is always an easy way to pick up first down. Ball on the 43-yard line. Number 26, the lone back. With the pass. And pass ball is incomplete. Bates was the intended receiver on that play. And this is the eighth play of this drive. Seattle goes with a four-man front. Tucks it away. Humby is there for the tackle at the 42. Number 26 takes it up the middle for a yard or two. Third down in the spot they'll have to reach for a first is the 33. One of us will make a play. Number 21, the lone setback. Closing in with the pass. It's batted away. Great effort up front to put the pressure on. And you'll see that kind of thing out of these guys a lot. They're big and they're strong and they're fast. Opposing offensive line sure have their hands full when they get out in this field. He'll try to pin them close to the goal line. Won't take a chance trying to return this one. Both teams have played pretty well so far. It's still anyone's game. First and ten. Ball on the 20 yard line. Let's go, be good. All day, baby. Come on. Number 23, the deep foul. Come on. He'll pass on first down. With the throw, gets his hand on it. Sears was the one they were trying to get the ball to. Number 54 was there on the coverage. Second and ten. Ball on the 20 yard line. All on us, y'all. Watch this. Under pressure, he throws this one away. He didn't want to risk an interception and decides to throw it away. Ball on their own 20. Let's go! The 49ers line up in a five-receiver set this time. 
He somehow got that pass off. The play didn't work because the quarterback's timing and balance was off. When he starts to feel pressure, he gets a little nervous, and he has to get rid of the ball. Now here's the punt unit as the defense forces a three and out. He's waving for the fair catch. Fair it's catch still pretty man. early, but it's been an even game so far. We'll have to see who can take control on this drive. They'll Ball take on their own 46. The 46 yard line. First and 10. Using split back. Pull back hand off. Spins away from the tackle. Green is there for the tackle at the 44-yard line. You never know when you're going to find some room and break loose into the secondary. Ball on the 44-yard line. Ball on the 44-yard line. Will, will, will. Seattle goes with a four-man front. They give it to the halfback. Skip arm kicks him at first. So he picks up about five on that run, moving the chains in the process. The line did a great job there of blocking the backside pursuit, which helped him get the first down. Ball on the 38-yard line. Ball on the 38-yard line. Go low! Go low! Number 21, Balloon setback. Here we go, baby! Rock and roll! Hey, let's go! Receives the handoff. Cumby comes up to make the play at the 33. Number 21. Got the call on the draw. Six yard pickup. Second and four. Ball on the 33 yard line. Looking to run it here. McGuire is there for the tackle at the 29-yard line. Number 21 rumbles forward for a gain of four. Ball on the 29-yard line. Ball on the 29-yard line. One more, fellas. Stop here. Let's go. Drops back. Pressure coming. Great effort that time, John. He's clearly one of the best in the league. Yeah, he's one of those guys who's been playing for a while now. And let me tell you, he might never be better than he is right now. Hamilton will try to give his team the lead with this field goal attempt. Clearly not the result he was looking for. Field goal, they'll set up shot at the 41 yard line. Hey, watch the screen. The Seahawks line up in a 4 3. Wooden is there on the stop at the 45 yard line. So after that run, we can see how the two main threats on the ground have fared so far. Ball on their own 45. Ball on the 45 yard line. Get it started. The Seahawks come out in a dime package. Drops back with the throw. He hits his receiver. Number 30 is there for the tackle at the 39. You give him some time, he'll hit his man. And the thing is, he doesn't care how big that window is. With his accuracy, everyone's open. Number 23, the deep man. They give it to the halfback. Wooden comes up to make the play. At the 33. Number 23. Got the call on the draw. Six yard pickup. Second and four. Ball on the 33 yard line. Keep it up. With a counter play. 
Flack is there for the tackle at the 23. Good execution there, John. The blockers sold it, and the back did the rest. First and 10. Ball on the 23 yard line. Out of the eye formation. He'll pass on first down. Gets rid of it. And he oh he had it lost it incomplete. There's not one wide receiver who can ever play when he's never dropped a pass. It's just part of the game. Second and ten. Ball on the 23 yard line. The Seahawks line up in a 4-3. With the carry, they'll go with a play fake. This pass is incomplete. Can't complete the short pass attempt, so they'll have a third down now. Third and 10. Ball on the 23-yard line. Dimebacks in for this play. Let's go. Gets rid of it. Right on target to the wide receiver. The pass was fired in there so hard, I think he left smoking the ball. They're 11 yards away from the end zone. Last time they were down here, they settled for a field goal. Number nine with the carry. One yard loss on the play. And this is the ninth play of this drive. They're inside the 15. Drops back. Pressure throws to the end zone. Touchdown, San Francisco. This is a good play by the offense in the red zone. The wide receiver is going to break away right here and come up with a catch and the touchdown. The point after is good. Hey, as an offensive coach in this league, you're always making adjustments. And hopefully you can get the defense on its heels and get it in there for the touchdown. Good job by these guys. Waller is back and ready to put this one in the air. This one is taken by Barnes. They missed a field goal attempt on their last drive. Now they're ready to get started again. Let's see what happens. Ball on their own 20. Start the drive at the 20 yard line. First and 10. Seattle lines up in a 4-3. Play action. Gets rid of it. I think the quarterback just let that one get away. Dwyer was his intended target. Second and 10. Ball on the 20-yard line. Score right. Danny, Danny, Danny. Seattle using three linebackers. Play. Green is there on the stop. These guys that can shrug off tackles are great to have in your backfield. Some of these guys are big and they just run over the defender. While other guys wait until the defender commits and they use a move or a juke or a spin to get out of a tackle. The 49ers with a four man front. Misdirection. 
lane. Is there for the well, tackle on the at the 40. Game Number 21 has on just gone over the century mark. Second, second down, two to go Ball on the 40-yard line. So we've reached the end of the, the, end of the third quarter, quarter with the 49ers, the 49ers ahead of the Seahawks, 22-13. And we'll start the fourth quarter. Ball on their own 40. Ball on the 40-yard line. The 49ers line up in a 4-3. Gets rid of it. He was tipped. Brown was the intended receiver on that play. Green had the coverage on the play. Third and two. Ball on the 40-yard line. Let's go. Watch your eyes. The offense has had trouble moving the sticks on third down so far. With the pass. Almost intercepted. He was in the right place at the right time, and that saved them from giving up a lot of yardage. Anthony will come in now to punt it away. Bannister looks like he's ready for the return. He signals for a fair catch. Fair catch made at the 23-yard line. The ball on their own 23. Start the drive at the 23-yard line. First and 10. Number 23 lines up behind his fullback in the eye. Tucks it away. Murphy is there on the stop. Number 23 runs it through the middle again of about six. Second and four. Only one man back. Hand it off. He's brought down behind the line for a short loss. Big tackle there for loss and great pursuit there, John. He can say that again. He knows how to prepare, and it really pays off when you make stops like that. It's third down and five to go. The Seahawks with a four-man front. With the pass. And he makes the grab. They'll spot this one at the 37. He records his third tackle of the game. It's usually a good call to throw it in his direction, John. Yeah, he's got some of the best hands in the league. He'll catch just about anything he can get to. I think he's most effective when they really need to catch. Third down and things like that. That's when he really shines out there. The Seahawks line up in a 4-3. Here we come. Gets the call. Black comes up to make the play at the 43-yard line. Number 22 runs it through the middle again of about six. Second and four coming up here. Come on. With a counter play. Dropped in the backfield for a short loss. You know, Johnny always seems to be in perfect position to make a play. He's all about effort. His motor's always running at 100%, and he's got the experience to diagnose plays very quickly. Third, Third and six. six. Ball on the 41 yard line. The Seahawks with a four man front. Cross play to the left. Murphy brings him down before he can reach the marker. The third down run, not enough to keep the drive alive, so the punting team coming in. There's nothing wrong with trying to grind it out in the fourth quarter when you're playing with a lead. Allen is ready to punt this one away. Barnes lines up deep for the punt return. And he 
signals for the fair catch. Time's running out, so they're going to have to score quickly. I hope that the defense holds them so they have a chance to pull one out at the end. The first and ten. Will start the drive at the 18-yard line. First and ten. The 49ers come out in a 4-3. And up to the fullback. Newberry is there for the tackle at the 20. Gain of about a yard. It's second down and eight to go. Seattle comes out in their nickel pack. Throws it. And he's knocked out of bounds at the 48-yard line. This is what they have to do. Keep making completions down the field and move the chain. Watch this one. He knows he's got to get the first, and he picks the right guy to throw it to. Ball on their own 49. Ball on the 49 yard line. Hey, let's go one deep. Bring it up, bring it up. The 49ers with a four man front. Let's go. Going long. He's there for the catch. Swift is there on the stop at the 16 yard line. score in this fourth quarter drive. Second and long. Ball on the 22-yard line. The 49ers come out in a dime package. Closing in. He'll be credited with the sack. And his teammates deserve kudos too because they didn't allow the receivers to get any separation. It's now third and long after the set. This team has to start converting on third down if they're going to be successful. Gets the pass off. Brown is there for the tackle at the 12 yard line. Bradford appears to have sustained an injury and will make his way to the sideline under his own power. It's fourth down now, five yards to go. Under 10, 10. Stay at home. Here we go. There's no hesitation here. They're going to go for it. Under pressure, looks to the end zone. Ooh, nearly picked off. The offense turns the ball over on downs. They needed to keep the ball and try to score. Maybe next time they may try something a little different from the playbook. San Francisco. The injury sustained earlier was minor, and they expect him to return to the game after a series or two. Alexander comes in motion. Hands it off to the back. Knight is there on the stop at the 17. Number 23 runs it through the middle again of about six. Second and five. Ball on the 17 yard line. Let's turn it up, D. Hand off to the tailback. Barnes is there for the tackle at the 23-yard line. 
solid yardage on that run. You know, people say you got to run the ball, you got to control the clock, but the key thing is you have to run the ball successfully. You have to establish a threat that you're going to make the defense respect. Let's go, be Come on. Nickelback in this time. Watch this. Not today. Hey, watch that screen. First Two minutes ten. to go. Ball on the 23 yard line. One more, fella. Here we go, baby. It's show time, baby. Let's go. From the start, from the start. Hey, let's go. Hey, 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 hey. Do it, do it. off to the back. Number 30 comes up to make the play. At the 29 yard line. Number 22. Kept his legs moving. Gets seven hard earned yards. Seattle calls a timeout. They have two remaining. Bradford was taken out earlier with a minor injury, but now returns to the game. The Seahawks come out in a 4-3. Murphy is there for the tackle at the 27-yard line. Third and five. Ball on the 27-yard line. Number 23 in the backfield. They give it to the halfback. Murphy comes up to make the play at the 30. Well, that didn't cut it. Now they're looking at fourth down. And they made the decision to just keep it on the ground. Take time off the clock, not force anything. This is a luxury of being ahead. Yeah, Allen comes into the game for the punt. Barnes is the deep return man. Fair catch goal for. Time's running out for them. If they want to get back in this game, they're going to have to find a way to get into the end zone on this possession. The Seahawks will start the drive at the 35 yard line. First and 10. The Seahawks line up in a five receiver set this time. Danny, Danny, Danny. Here we go. Gets rid of it. Almost picked off. And they had to go to the air because they need big plays and fast. That's right. You gotta have composure in these situations. Find your receivers who can pick up yardage after the catch. But most importantly, you have to keep the chains moving. Seven defensive backs in on this one. Drops back. Pressure coming. Going long. He can't bring it down in bounds. No choice here, John. They just have to keep throwing. Yeah, they do. Running the ball isn't going to do a whole lot of good now. Third and ten. Ball on the 35-yard line. I think this defense looks forward to these third down situations because they've been stopping them today. Pressure with the throw. Right on target to the wide receiver. With the pass, incomplete pass. John, he rushed that throw. And you should credit the defensive line. They do a nice job tying up the blockers and can bring pressure up the middle. 
when you combine their play with the fact that the defensive coordinator likes to bring additional blitzers from the outside, it can make for a very long day for the quarterback. The Seahawks line up in a five receiver set this time. Throws it. Drops the interception. What the defense is doing is they're watching the quarterback's eyes. They're cluing. They're in position so that whatever happens, the ball is in front of them. And that time, it almost got him an interception. Here's a look at the third down success rate of each team. With the throw, nearly intercepted. Oh boy, none of the defenders can hang on to it. That's the third drop interception on this drive. Yeah, they're all over the field, but they can't come up with the catch it. Incomplete. Hey, let's go one deep. Hey. He'll just take a knee. Broadcast or other use of the descriptions and accounts of this game without the expressed written permission of EA Sports is prohibited. This is Al Michaels. Good night. <laughs>